fears have emerged that King Charles's olive branch to Prince Harry and his wife Meghan Markle is a forlorn desire after so much pain. Many commentators have commended the extent to which the passing of Queen Elizabeth II has brought much of the country, indeed, much of the world, together in mourning. Billions yesterday watched Her Majesty's state funeral as the royal family, surrounded by world leaders, came together to pay their final respects for the former monarch. But fears have already arisen that it could already have been too late to rekindle a strong bond between the senior royals and the Duke and Duchess of Sussex. In his first speech as King, Charles III made special reference to his youngest son. He said, I, want to express my love for Harry and Meghan as they continue to build their lives overseas. Prince Harry himself later ended a tribute to his grandmother noting, As it comes to first meetings, we now honor my father in his new role as King Charles III. But behind the words, it is understood that efforts are being made to shore up relations, and quick. Fears Charles Olive Branch to Harry and Meghan is forlorn desire after so much pain. Image, Getty, let them through, William's kind gesture to Harry and Meghan at Queen's funeral The two royal brothers were united in grief and the Prince of Wales took the opportunity to reach out to Harry and Meghan at Street. George's Chapel in Windsor. Read more here. Writing in the mail, Richard K. argued, Charles hope is that, having been so much part of the spectacular events of the past week and a half, his son finally realizes that the qualities of duty and service celebrated in the national outpouring of heartfelt affection for the Queen are the true measure of popularity. He concluded, it may be a forlorn hope. Prince Harry and Meghan stepped back from senior royal duties in 2020 before moving to California. It is due to this decision that the royal couple were not invited, or, according to reports, were invited and then uninvited to a grand reception at Buckingham Palace, hosted by the King and the Queen Consort, over the weekend. Read more, Russia panicking over Ukraine's counter-offensive Prince Harry and Meghan Markle. Image, Getty, Harry, Meghan, William, and Kate. Image, Getty, this is also the reason for the Duke being told he could not wear a military uniform at most events surrounding his grandmother's death. Mr. K said it appears Harry has still not grasped the consequences of quitting royal life. He added that the king, too, could find it difficult to welcome Harry back into the fold, even if such a genuine offer was to be accepted. Read more, Meghan and Harry's decision to bring Archie and Lilibet to UK, reveal, Prince William adorably pulls faces at baby and crowds watched by Kate. Report, Kate's sweet words as Prince William and Harry reunited, Insight, Prince Harry, A Life in Pictures. Image, Express, King Charles. Image, Getty, Trending The writer noted that Harry's ongoing habit of giving interviews as well as his planned memoir has been more personally hurtful. Biographer Tom Bauer also told GB News that, Following the passing of the Queen, there is now no one in court who is fighting for Harry and Meghan. That the body language of the royals over recent days suggests a reconciliation is about to occur is, he added, nonsense. While the state funeral of Her Majesty has passed, the royal family will remain in a period of royal mourning for a further seven days, so key members of the firm are unlikely to engage in any public engagements in the immediate future.